schools good there are a lot of activities conducted there are many uh, not just academics but uh, you know, they have dance music swimming karate all these things hi Welcome to Illustrate, your very own school search engine that helps you find the best schools for your kid based on various filters and parameters. Today, we are Ms. Nishita, whose kid is studying in the Salter Global School, which is in Appapur in Hyderabad. Let's speak to her and understand what made her choose the school and what she thinks about the school overall. Thank you so much for joining us, ma'am. Yeah, thank you. Ma'am, to begin with, what made you to choose yeah. the school uh, when you were searching for a good school for your kid? What was so impressive about the school that you have decided to join your kid in this? Uh, <laughs> sorry to say this, but uh, it it was not something uh, about school. Uh, it was like uh, my husband got a job here in this school, so for me it was easier for to send him to this school because it will be you know uh, convenient for us. Which because uh, we were not here, we we didn't know much about the school. We just moved in from Maldives and. Uh, Oh, he came here, got a job, and then so that's the reason why we selected. After all these years, what do you think about the school? How is it? What is what is it that you're liking about the school? Uh, school is good. There are a lot of activities conducted. There are many, uh, not just academics, but uh, you know they have dance, music, swimming, karate. All these things are taught to them. and some foreign languages he my kid learns french so that way it's good. the general perception is igcse has a lot of syllabus to cover and it is only meant for those with great learning abilities is that really the case i want to hear a parent's perspective about it uh, is it required for the kid to come back spend long hours trying to understand the concepts and is it really challenging for all the kids i can't actually generalize because i think it will be uh, different for each uh, kid my kid is actually a little uh, you know he learns quickly and he manage I, for him it is not a big deal this uh, curriculum so it's not too much for him he he manages he studies whatever is uh, i mean what is he does what is expected of him got it and how's the teachers and their support been for your kid quality uh, of teaching yeah teaching maybe i think it can be improved no more it's like uh, most of the schools they follow this traditional way of teaching just uh, it's like one way i think it should be more interactive and it must be like they can make it more creative like doing things more practically actually doing you know like experiments and all that and then that way when the uh, kids learn they'll uh, remember if you just go a uh, stick or chalk or a blackboard whatever and just teach i don't think that it works these days it, it it used to work before not not now and nowadays it's like um, they uh, teachers if you are saying it's created that this they just playing a video i think that is also not good is there any other area where you think the school can get better or can focus more on yeah i think uh, they should practice more of practical teaching rather than classroom teaching got it and uh, yeah. in the management when it comes to the management how accessible is the management in case if you have any questions or concerns is it easy to reach out to them uh no absolutely not for this school you know the only uh, time i meet the te- with meet my kids teachers are for the ptm if i don't go to the ptm i, I don't get to meet them and if i have some issues and i need to talk to them they are absolutely not accessible we do not have their numbers we do not have anything like before when my kid used to study in maldives we used to have a, a group whatsapp group where all the parents and the teacher this the teacher and the parents used to communicate to us or we could have to communicate with the teacher we could do that you know but uh, here uh, we do not have their numbers we do not have any contact with the, with the teachers except for the btm meeting that too you know we can't always go you know because of uh, working and all that so i think uh, that should be they should do something about it when my uh, kid used to study in maldives we used to have i used to know all his teachers everything about him and his he has nothing no contact with the teachers at all and, and something that a lot of parents are very keen about is school balancing both co curricular activities and uh, the academic excellence how is it being practiced at saltec global school yeah that also uh, i have an issue with that too 
they are conducting classes, dance, music, or uh, sports, whatever. However, uh, they are, these classes are not given much importance and uh, they are not regularly conducted. I think uh, they are scheduled in the timetable. So I think they should uh, go as for the scheduled classes. I think they give more importance to the academic uh, classes rather than uh, all these. These are conducted, but occasionally, not regularly. Thank you so much for, for your time, ma'am. Uh coming forward and sharing all these yeah. thoughts and opinions will be of great help for other parents who are looking for good schools. Yeah, yeah. All right. Thank you very much for your time. Thanks. Thank you, Ramesh.